Hey, how's it going? I hope you're doing well. Today I wanted to talk about what I've been working on, and that is compassion. Um, having compassion towards others, um, being compassionate, so the act of uh, compassion. And compassion itself is not necessarily uh, empathy, although empathy does play a part in it. I believe sympathy also plays a part in compassion. But I believe compassion is um, the emergence of something even higher from those two uh, core uh, ideas of uh, empathy and sympathy. Now, empathy is uh, feeling what other people feel. So really, um, if you're a very uh, empathetic person, um, sometimes called empaths, you are able to really uh, deeply feel maybe sometimes even more so than the person going through that emotion sympathy is doing things because you feel bad for that person right um, so it's feeling bad for a person uh, versus uh, feeling what the other people are feeling so uh, I believe again the compassion is much bigger than that uh, it's not just a combination of the two um, compassion comes from a much deeper place it's not based on emotion it's not based just on intellect and it's not just based on the gut but a combination a very solid place very deep place and um, compassion is not something that wavers uh, as an emotion will it's not as cold as intellect can be okay and it's not as abstract as what the gut would lead on to tell you and I I'm not the perfect person to explain this there's a lot of many 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 other people that can explain what compassion is but today what I want to talk about I just wanted to kind of get that out there so um, you understand where I'm coming from and compassion uh, and the practice of it and you know like I mentioned I'm working on that right now and the difficulties of being compassionate, having, uh, taking action on compassion. And as with anyone else, when you're in a good state, when you're feeling good, when you're in a good mood, um, expressing compassion is easy. Now, for example, let's say you watched a documentary or a video clip or heard a story which evokes compassion for maybe the next hour or two maybe a little bit longer expressing compassion is easy now all that stuff fades right and you're left with being who you were uh, prior to watching the video hearing the stories listening to um, a story whatever it may be but what I've been working on is to have continual compassion and so I've been noticing myself compassion is easy to express when you're in a uh, like I mentioned good state but the true test comes when you're busy you're stressed and you're in a bad mood uh, state those are the times that compassion is most needed but the hardest to express and feel and so I've been working on being a lot more aware and understanding that everyone has their own battle every single person has their own battle they're they're fighting inside maybe it's uh, outside and we don't know about it right sometimes we do and when we do know it's easier to be compassionate but the people uh, maybe it's a homeless person out on the street. We don't know what they've gone through. Right? And it may be the saddest story. 
We don't know. We have to have compassion. Even the person that was rude to us, maybe we're driving, they cut us off. Maybe we're out shopping and they were just rude. Maybe they're going through something. Maybe it's just that, you know, it stems from childhood. Maybe that it's how they were raised. And in those times, when people offend you, having compassion, those are the times when you really need to、uh, express and bring out the compassion, but the most difficult. And of course,、uh, for myself too, it's been difficult. And at the same time, really trying to catch myself、uh, when I am in a bad mood, when I am maybe even focused really hard on a task and maybe someone comes to me and I can't switch that easily from focus mode to, oh, let me sit and listen to、uh, your question or whatever it may be. And little by little, we can make progress by、uh, continuing to being,、uh, continuing being、uh, aware of、uh, our own internal state when we're dealing with others.、Um, and this is also to your pets, other animals, or、um, the world. So I hope you. Are working on it, might not be compassion, it may be something else.、Uh, best of luck to you and uh, continued uh, success, whatever success means to you.、Uh, continue, continual growth, I should say,、uh, in whatever you're working on right now. And so,、um, as usual, I'm sending you good vibes. Tell me what you think. What are you working on right now? And that's it. Have a great day. Sending you good vibes. Looking forward to talking to you very soon. Take care.